love people who do this. Oh my God. Oh God, back when I used to work in an electronics store, this was endless. Like you could not go a week without having to just unscrew a keyboard. It was, it just, it sends me up a wall seeing this. This upsets me on a spiritual level. Hello everybody and welcome to Calbus. My name is Lumo and today we are looking at r slash hardware gore, a subreddit dedicated to just, just the worst things that can happen to hardware. It's it's upsetting. It's an upsetting subreddit for people who like being upset. So let's just get mad together and let's just get right into it. I didn't need that HDMI anyway. Oh, 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 oh God. is that what it looks like under there? That's really not great. I'm really sorry to hear that, my friend. But at the very least, you got the cap out. Like if that got stuck inside of your, you know, expensive equipment, that's just no good. That would be like the end of days. That is God. Oh my, I'm sorry. I'm just imagining this getting stuck in my like 2070 super in my computer. It's just like, ugh, I hate the concept. I hate the concept. Bought a new calculator for school. Didn't even get to use it once before I broke it. How did you break it? How did that happen? And also, this is a really fancy, this is a really fancy calculator. Is that a second screen? Like what is that for displaying graphs? Like what? This is so fancy. I'm sorry. I'm kind of losing it. This is like bringing me back to high school, but it's also like, why this calculator is so fancy. Why is it so fancy? Our drive was broken. So I replaced it with a new one and the keyboard won't go on. <laughs> no, no. This is why I don't do repairs on my laptops. I just accept they've become e-waste and that's that. I send them in for recycling, of course, but it's like, I just, I just, I just don't know how to do this. I just don't know how to do this. It's, ah, oh, it's terrifying because like, there's such a slim margin of error that like, if something goes wrong and something will go wrong, it's, it's Poe's law. Like, I just, I, I'll still be out the money, you know? So I just never do this. But you know what I do do? I like, comment, and subscribe every Calbus video that I see. That's right, I unsubscribe and then resubscribe every video. Now, I go a little bit further than most, but if you just want to subscribe once, leave a like and a comment, well, by God, I'd appreciate that. It would help us make more content for you. Let's keep going. Just got my new PC case! No! No! Bad! You stop that! That box is gonna catch fire! That- Counselor, <laughs> this is so upsetting. This is so genuinely upsetting, but like, it's funny. It's killing me. That power supply and that, 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 that graphic, it's just going to catch on fire. And like, you don't have to use cardboard for that. If you want your PC to catch fire, just get a 4090. <laughs> just get that Xbox Series SS card. Oh my God. This is, this is like an actual hazard. Do not do this. This is an actual hazard. Razer keyboard mod fail. Uh, no, that's not how you replace the switches, my dude. Apparently they were trying to replace the Razer Greens with Acro Silvers, but uh, they didn't have a switch puller, so it went horribly. I, look, as someone who replaced all the keycaps on his Razer keyboard, this was like the one thing I feared, and I'm so glad to know that that fear was justified in some capacity. How did you even do this? How, how, how did you manhandle it this bad? That is so bad. Yummy thermal paste! This must be okay, right? I don't think it is. I think you just put steel wool on your processor. <laughs> no! How did- Does thermal paste get fuzzy normally? Is that something I need to be concerned about? Okay, no, it's just a dust bunny someone put there because it's funny. Okay, good. Wondering what kind of creatures might be in here. Uh, none. Nicotine is a pesticide, apparently. What happened to that ram stick? How is that ram stick just free floating there? That- That I think is like the scariest part. It like, it was either taken in mid-flight or the cobweb is holding up a ram stick, which, which are not light by any means, light enough for a spider at least. So it's like, oh God, that's so vile. Just imagine, imagine the stench. Never thought I would see this. Oh my God. That, that is a well-functioning billboard display at the Capitol building. That is just, oh, I love that. I love that. I hope to see that one day my 2016 iPhone SE. Uh, yeah, the SE is for a uh, singular, 
singular explosion. Because really, your lithium battery is expanding in there, and the screen is cracked. It's not going good. It's not going good. I didn't... I also didn't know that the iPhone SE looked like the, like, first generation iPod touches. I... that... Look, I'm enamored by this. I'm kind of enamored by this. I love the fact that it is just the old iPhone from, like, way back in my little baby years. I love this. It's so good. I mean, it's not good. I'm sorry for your phone, but... <laughs> I won't work. What? What are you doing? Are you are you trying to pry open your calc? I mean, it's working. The calculator's open, but yeah, I feel like there's a reason this won't work. I'm looking at the comments, and it's just like, have you tried turning it off and on again? I tried, but the battery fell in. It ain't got no gas in it. Didn't know that. Where does the gas go? Have you tried rice? Oh, good idea. <laughs> <laughs> I am enamored with the comments just sh posting. Uh, oh, this thing still works surprisingly. It just, it's just boned if water gets in it. Not sure if this follows the first rule as I knew. The story was I was getting off the bus, almost fell, and my headphones hit my head. So wait, is this the inside of like a, a gamer headset or something? Like, were you wearing that to school? What, what headphones? have this dongle with like an actual slider on it like that's unusual to me because most you know most people are using bluetooth headphones so it's like i'm so confused but at the same time it's like this is just cool to see the inside of you know i like circuitry i like how it looks it's very pleasing it, it is they are called wafers and by god they are a cookie for my eye this tablet that i found buried under an ipad what what, so there was an iPad. I take it this was like a hoarding situation, but like the burden on this is so bad. Also, hi, MK. How you doing? But like the burden on this is so just awful. Like this is an old, like crappy Amazon tablet, which is kind of not great. Those were like awful. Oh, wait, no, it's not. It is a, a Tesco Huddle 2, which also isn't good. But either way, like. This thing has been through hell, and it still works. Rate my setup. I don't think it's set up, so I think you cannot legally call it a setup. And in fact, I think I'm going to come after you with the full extent of the law. Again, laptop repairs terrify me. They're such slim, slim things and just one thing going wrong. And it's, it's just a nightmare. But also, this is really cool to see it all disassembled, you know? Like, I f again, I find hardware fascinating. Also, that one mat that we all had as a kid in the bottom right, they unironically have the like the city car map. And that means that this setup is a 10 out of 10 regardless. Friend's mom tried to take the SIM card out with a sewing needle. Oh, <laughs> oh no. How? How? How did it get this bad? How did it get this bad? No. No, no, I look, I, I'm not playing this up. That's the thing that should have worked. A sewing needle is small enough to activate the SIM eject, right? Like, and this is, this is clearly an Android phone. So like the SIM card is probably replaceable. It's not like an iPhone where you have to go into it. So like, how did you mess this up so bad? How, how did you mess this? And how is the software having such like an issue that it is duplicating like the bottom bar over and over and over and over and over and over and over. And over. That's that's obscene to me. That's awful. And that's all the time we have here today on Calbus. If you like this, make sure to subscribe, leave a like, maybe share this with a friend who could use a reminder that, hey, don't. If you don't want more r slash hardware gore, there will be another one popping up on your screen in just a couple of seconds. But until then, my name has been Lumo and I hope to see you in the very next Calbus video. Have a great rest of your day.